Hi, my name is Bree Clark and I'm a software expert. And today I'm going to show you how to find upper and lower quintiles in Microsoft Excel. Now you may already know that Excel has a quartile function. In other words, the top, middle, and bottom 25% brackets within 100% scale. But it does not have a function for quintile, so we're going to have to use the percentile function to do this. In this spreadsheet, I have a variety of temperature values, and I want to calculate both the upper and lower quintile. Let's start with the upper. I'm going to type an equal sign and then type percentile. And I'm going to use the second one, percentile.inc. And open the parentheses. And then I'm going to choose the array I want to use for the calculation, which is going to be all of my temperature values. So I'm just going to click and drag to select all of those cells, B2 through B18. Then I'll type a comma, and the upper quintile would be 0 0.8, or the 80th percentile. I'll close the parentheses and press Enter, and I find out that that value is 47. For the lower quintile, I'll do something very similar. Equals percentile.inc, open the parentheses, select the range, comma, but instead of 0.8, I'm going to use 0.2. So I'll type 0.2, close the parentheses, and press enter. And I see that my lower quintile is 43.2 for this range. My name is Bree Clark. I'm a software expert, and I just showed you how to calculate the upper and lower quintiles of a data range in Microsoft Excel.